saw you stand up uh, set recently at, at Night Train, your show at Littlefield. Oh, right. It was a great show. And you were talking about how you just recently introduced vegetables into your diet. I did, <laughs> yes. <laughs> How's this coming along? Uh, not great. Yeah. Not great. They're, vegetables are terrible. <laughs> That's 37 years I'd gone without really eating them. And yeah, they're bad. Uh, it's Scott, Scott's date Friday night is a vegetarian. Really? Yeah. Oh. I, my you, sister, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, so. Oh, right, yes. That's how my I, dad knows about my, my dating life. Yeah. <laughs> um, there is something, I will say, though, uh, there is something, vegetarians are kind of fun, because vegetarians are always, like, three drinks away from a cheeseburger. <laughs> yeah. Like, that is something that's always great, is just get, like, three vodkas in a vegetarian and it's just, you know what I miss? Bacon! And so that can be fun. That, you yeah. could... It's a fun game to play to try to push a vegetarian to the limit. Especially if it's your sister. Yeah. Because then, oh, that's an, that's an angry Thanksgiving. <laughs> what is, what, have, you, have you stumbled upon a favorite vegetable? Have you, done, have you tried the Indian food? The Indian vegetable food? That stuff's great, man. Like what, what like, are you... Like bangan, bajan, like the, the eggplant stuff? Oh my god, they do a great eggplant. No. You gotta no. do it. You gotta no, it's okay. Go for it. No, it's all right. It's all right. I'll stick with uh, kale and bacon. Kale. But bacon. But bacon. Ba Actually, it's bacon and kale. Yeah. Uh, bacon and kale, bacon and Brussels sprouts. <laughs> yeah. Really, bacon, and then if you can slip something in, great. Yeah. So, really, it's just I've introduced more bacon into my life. <laughs> I want to slip one last thing in here with you uh, and talk about your production career now. Uh, oh, sure. Yeah. This is a relatively new thing as well. Uh, you co-executive produced a movie recently with some guy named Jay-Z. Yes. Uh, yes, Jay-Z and I Jay -Z. are producing partners. Except you never met Jay-Z, I hear. That's the... No, no. It's <laughs> a very work? weird thing to be an executive producer with Jay-Z and have never uh, met Jay-Z. <laughs> uh, and it's weird because people, they, there were posters for the movie that were like in the subway and stuff and so people would text me and call me and they'd be like, you and Jay-Z are making a movie together. Oh, that's awesome. I got a demo. And... <laughs> I would listen to their demos and... <laughs> Uh, but I never, I never met Jay-Z, it was, I don't, I don't know how he got involved in the film. I got involved at a different point in the, in the movie. It's a movie that mixes uh, live action and animation. It's called An Oversimplification of Her Beauty. And uh, it's an interesting film and there's, so there's a lot of animation in it. And I got brought in because I used to work in animation and that's actually where I started. And so, uh, King of the Hill. Yes, I used to. I used to work on King uh, of the Hill. People don't know everything about you the way I do because I've been researching right. you for the last three days. <laughs> well, when you just say it like that, it just sounds like you're just like a Tourette thing. That like, <laughs> like you didn't give them context. It well, was you just gave like context. You said animation, King of the Hill. But that could have been like you could have just been saying, "Oh, right, animated shows like King of the Hill. I love that show. <laughs> what show did you work on?" <laughs> I worked on What's New Scooby-Doo. Yeah. Um, no. My Little Pony. Uh, but yeah, so I, I got involved with it because they, uh, they needed some help finishing up some of the animation stuff. So my contribution was just kind of like helping out with that. Um, I don't know uh, what Jay-Z's <laughs> actual con I don't know if he was giving notes. I don't know. <laughs> If he went on set, um, just gave everyone free Brooklyn Nets tickets. That, that was. I uh, wish. Yeah. Good lord, that's the one thing that I, I really, at some point, thought I should take one of those posters and just walk into the Barclays Center, <laughs> uh, just with my ID out in the poster, and like, Jay Z's not using his tickets tonight, but he said it was cool for me. Like, we make we make movies together. Yeah. So excuse me, I'll. <laughs> I'm gonna go give the team a pep talk. 